In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can create a collage using a collage template. So once you're in your Kizzo account, simply go to the Collage Maker tab. And right away, you'll be given an option of three of how you would like to make your collage. So I'm going to choose a middle one, which will be a collage template. And I'm given a list with all of the templates that I can choose from. So since I'm using wedding photos, I'm going to go ahead and choose a template that is more wedding themed. Uh, maybe this one. Once you select a template, the preview will appear right here on the right so you can see what it's going to look like. Uh, so I think this one's pretty perfect, so I'm going to go ahead and choose it. Um, you'll see that there are two options. This one is uh, already set to the animated template because it does have movement. If I wanted to, I could switch it to a still template. That way it'll be a still image and there won't be any movement. But I like the animated version, so I'm going to keep the animated template option and continue with choose. So now I am going to be able to choose which photos I want. At the bottom of this window, you'll see that it's going to tell you how many photos you can add to this specific template. So I can add three photos. So I'm going to go ahead and select three. So one, two, and three. I'll click apply. And now you can see that my collage has been made with the three photos. Uh, if I want to change the text on the collage, I will simply click on the text and erase the text that was here. I think I like the, yeah, I'll remove that all and just type in our wedding. Perfect. So I'm going to center it. So I'll click it, drag it a little bit down and maybe I'll make it a little bit bigger. Perfect. I can preview the collage by clicking on the play button down here since it is an animated collage. And I think it turned out really nice. Um, so since I'm pretty satisfied with it, I think it looks great. I'm going to go ahead and let it finish playing. And once it's done, I'll be able to save my collage. So I'll go ahead and click save down here. And while it's saving, just so you can keep in mind, uh, you even if you are using a template, you can personalize anything you want. So you could switch out the photos, you can resize them, you can, like as you saw, I could put whatever text I want. So really the options are all up to you. Okay, so now to find my collage that I just saved, I'm going to go to the My Images tab. And in the My Collages album, I will now see that I have my animated collage here. And that's all. See you next time.